good morning, one and all. Uh, I listened to Marcy the other day, and uh, it was okay. I don't remember what my reaction was to it. But uh, I got a request from Lust for Awesomeness. And if you're going to lust after anything, I guess it should be awesomeness. But anyway, uh, asked me to do The Smiths. Last night I dreamt somebody loved me. And I didn't know anything about The Smiths. Um, so in my searching to find the song, I discovered that Morrissey was in The Smiths. So it was a little like, oh, okay. Now I get what's going on here. So I have to admit... I um, listened to the to it already once, just because I shouldn't have, but I did. And honesty is the best policy. So, uh, but I will give you my honest opinion when we're done here. Uh, and oh, by the way, we've hit 270 subscribers, so woohoo on that. Uh, okay, so back to this. Last night I dreamt somebody loved me. Uh, I'm told it has a long intro, but it's worth the wait uh, in the end. So, all right, Smiths, see what you got. Sometimes it does me good to listen to something once and it just washes over me and I really don't quite pick up on it. It takes a time or two to get it. I hear what I perceive to be a lot of screaming, screaming and yelling in the background. And in, in listening to this already, I get the impression that Marcy is very um, I don't want to say emotional, but I guess that, that fits. His lyrics are full of angst. What I've heard, two songs. I can't judge from two songs, but second listen I even drug up the lyrics and read through the lyrics. Last night I dreamt that somebody loved me. No hope, no harm, just another false love. Yeah, uh, um, musically, which is where I come from, it's okay, you know, it's, it's there to carry the lyrics along. No hope, no harm, just another false love. So he dreamt that someone loved him. They woke up and realized it was just a dream. And now he's kind of flipping out because how long is it going to be until it's not just a dream? So, I get all of that, and for me, 
like I've said before, other videos, I'm not lyrically oriented. Honestly, I don't really care about what someone's angst is about love and relationships and the lack thereof. I pay attention to music. And this is a song where if you are into that stuff and it moves you, these lyrics, this song is for you. I read some of the comments underneath the uh, video, and there were people who totally related to this. And they were like, pouring out their soul practically on YouTube, or in the lyrics, in, in the uh, comment section. And that's fine, you know, I can appreciate that. But for me, again, I really don't care about all, not that I don't care about somebody's problems, but it's almost like I, I don't want to hear it in music. You know, I like a good lyric. I like a good harmony. I've said that before. But as far as like the woe is me kind of, oh, I'm in misery. When is it going to end kind of a thing? I, I, I don't care about that stuff. I don't want, it's not something I would listen to and really relate and just, oh my God, you've got to hear this because it's just the t most totally awesome song in the world. I'm not criticizing somebody who likes this stuff. If you do, wonderful. Enjoy it, listen to it, spread the word, but I don't care. Um, I know it's not a positive <laughs> review, but I have to be honest. I can't, I'm not gonna sit here and go, oh yeah, right, got it. It's totally a great song, and it's just wonderful. You know, musically, it was okay. Like I said, it just carried the lyrics along. And Morrissey seems to be one of these guys who it's just, that's where he's at. That's what he, his songwriting is all about. Like I say, I've only listened to two things, so maybe he's he does other uh, songs that are a little more upbeat and not so down and, you know, uh, what was me. So that's it. Sorry, folks, but, uh, you know, I, I don't say I dislike it. Musically, it's fine, and it's something I could listen to, and the singing is good, you know, it's all, it's fine, but it's just sort of misery with a tune to it. <laughs> so that's it, guys. Uh, don't hate me too much in the comments, and uh, you can give me thumbs down if you must, and that's fine, too, because I get it. Uh but uh, like I said, I did listen to it once, and I'm glad I did, only because I could give you a more honest opinion of what I truly think. So there you have it. All right, folks, come again sometime, unless this run you all off. <laughs> Later.